girls got tickets to the Grand Slam tomorrow. Yeah. And the slamming shows on me. Oh, I heard you're gonna rap live. That is so cool. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that's the plan. Um, excuse me, I forgot to make a phone call. Yeah. Chris. Be so good, right? Yo, uh, just a minute, I need to see. What's up, baby? How was your date at the Jazz Museum? If you could just excuse me for one second. Yo, easy, son. There are other females here. You don't have an original idea in your whole body, do you? What's your problem? My problem is you playing with Roxy's emotions and getting her all messed up in the head with your nonsense. Well, hold up. Preachers, boy. Right, you as much a part of this as me, so don't act all innocent. Yeah, I had my part in this, and now I'm starting to regret it. Listen, you need to chill out and get with me about this Grand Slam show tomorrow. We in this together, Cyrus, like it or not. And I got a little plan to make sure that my talent goes fully recognized, you feel me? Chris, you don't get it. Okay, you get up on that stage, you pop, you lock, you jump around like an extra fool, you got served. But you don't hear the music at all, and you don't feel it at all. And forget about your rapping skills, son. You couldn't rap a present if I spotted you a bow and some scotch tape. And you ain't nothing but a hater. Now, you know what else? Oh, you're a punk. Because you're one of the best rappers I've ever heard in my life, Cyrus. In my life. But every time Blaine comes around, you let him punk you up because you scared? And you ain't got no guts, son. With no heart. Just a win. I don't tolerate no fighting up in here. Now go home, get your mind right, but don't come back at all. Oh, You're on your own tomorrow. When everyone laughs at you, you'll see how it feels. I don't need you. I don't need nobody. <laughs> 